Hey guys, welcome to my vlog this week. I'm really excited to be here in Edinburgh, Scotland, where I've come down to um, a new cafe that's just opened up in central Edinburgh called Pomelo. And uh, these guys have been creating some Asian Scottish fusion food, which I'm really looking forward to trying. Uh, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks again for all your views, and let's see what these guys have got going here. So the first thing we're going to do is some hand-torn noodles and I've got uh, June here Hiya. and June's going to be showing us how to make noodles from hand so these are actually hand-torn noodles So we've made the Bian Bang noodles um, and I'm really excited to now try this Yang Yang noodles with spicy pork. So uh, we've got the noodles which have been freshly made and on top of that there was the chili paste which um, June showed us and then there was also the garlic paste as well and then we've got the spicy pork here, we've got flat leaf parsley, we've got some diced potatoes and some veg as well. So I've been told the main thing to do here is I've got to grab this and get it, get it high and twist it up so that it all mixes, <laughs> mixes together. This looks really amazing. It smells absolutely delicious. Let's see what we've got here. Mm. Really soft really aromatic. I'm getting a lot of the garlic and the parsley as well. Pork is really good, June. Really tasty. These uh, noodles, I've never actually had bang bang noodles before. And I've got to say they're delicious. They're really thick and really big, but they actually just melt in your mouth. Absolutely delicious, I'm looking forward to the next dish. That is fantastic. So my next dish is the Buddha bowl. And this looks really good. It's a vegan um, dish. It's got these um, two rice balls, it's got sesame seeds over it, got coriander, and it's almost like mixed veg. It sort of almost looks like um, sort of chunky kimchi. So let me try this one. Actually, it is like um, sort of spicy kimchi. I've got some grated carrots here and coriander. Very comforting, really delicious. A real mixture of different flavors in this one. Mmm. That's an absolute winner. Bits of cauliflower, zucchini, carrots, grated uh, cabbage. Very, very good. Loving this one. So now I've got this uh, bao. I've got sweet chili chicken bao here. And these are actually made from scratch here at Pomelo. And um, special flour that's used for making bao, which is slightly lower in gluten. I've got chicken in here. I've got raw onion. I've got um, a real mixture of different textures, um, which have been told is what they do here. And this looks really delicious. It's a bit of a mess to eat it. Hang on. Mmm. There's a chili, there's a soft chicken in there. It's lovely and warm. The bao bun, you can tell it's fresh and it's made here because it just is so soft and light, full of um, spongy bubbles in it as well. It's absolutely beautiful. I've had loads of baos in the past. This is really, really good. Lovely sriracha and it's absolutely delicious. Mmm. So now I'm gonna have dessert and I've got this um, really lovely homemade ice cream which is strawberry and gooseberry ice cream and on the top i've got these red gooseberries and these are called in scottish sour plumes mm. they're frozen 
really sour but sweet at the same time. And the ice cream has been handmade here. And there's like meringue in here as well. And this is strawberry and gooseberry. Beautiful and sweet, very, very creamy. Got a real balance of the flavors there with the gooseberry and also the strawberries. And then this is lovely, really ripe, locally sourced um, strawberries as well. That's delicious. Well, I've really enjoyed coming here to Pomelo. And if you guys are in Edinburgh and you want to come here, I really recommend that you come and visit. It's run by June. And as I say, it's been really great to see how the noodles are made and how all the produce is made. Everything is made here on the premises. And I've got to say the quality and the dedication that they put into this place is really great. I definitely recommend coming here. So um, thanks again for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Please read the description below. And I hope to see you next time for my next vlog. Take care. See ya. Cheers.